Hey guys, I'm Madison. And I'm Ryan. We are going to be diving into some good stuff. Today we're going to start with a video on the OE baseball team. Um, I'm here with Parker Esparza and I am Sam Ann Warren. <laughs> um, we are a part of the baseball team. Parker, how's the team looking so far this year? You know, we're looking pretty good. We're sitting at two and two. But we've had a few close games, and I think we could very easily be 4-0, and and I think we're going to win the state championship, so enough said. And then um, who would you say are some of the leaders on the team? Got to be Sam Man Warren. He is just a menace at the plate and can't get anything past him at catcher. So I would definitely say Parker Sparza as well. Um, godly outfielder. Nothing drops. <laughs> um, probably Charlie Bell as well. Uh, Tanner Twillman, Adrian Caginelli, of course. Shout out to the, the cameraman. And then uh, Blake Anderson, for sure, is one as well. And then uh, how is having a new coach? Uh, we get a lot more done. Um, it's a lot more fun, too. Don't really have to, like, I don't know. We don't dread going to practice every day. And it's just, just fun. Yeah, I think it's a lot easier to play baseball when you're having fun. And um, this coach does a very good job at that, unlike the last coach, so. Um, team expectations this year are definitely just to compete every single game and just have a lot of fun. Yeah, I'd say also win state, win, like win as many games as we can, but still have fun and um, compete every game and not have our off games like we might have had last night. <laughs> and then uh, who's going to hit the first round of the year is definitely going to be me. Just kidding. No, it's me, <laughs> actually. Uh, Grant Strong, for sure. If he can probably do, like, two more push-ups because in BP he keeps hitting the wall. So, yeah, I agree with that statement 100%. That's pretty good stuff there. The next thing we're going to check out is the weather. All right. It's, it's pretty bad out here, as you can tell. It's cloudy. It's windy. You can probably hear thunder. I don't know. Some sirens going off, somebody probably cla crashed, but I gotta tell you, the weather for next week. We're looking at cloudy on Monday, and you're gonna see some good sunny skies on Tuesday, and then after that, Wednesday through Friday, it's gonna be cloudy, rainy, water everywhere. You can expect that, you can count on that. Probably not gonna get school canceled. It's just rain, so don't get your hopes up, but you're going to see a lot of rain from Wednesday to Friday. Only sunny day is going to be Tuesday. Thanks, Hawks. That was just great. I'm kind of cold. Do you know where I could uh, borrow a sweatshirt? I don't have one on me, but you're in luck because I know where you can get one. Where? The OE Hawks Nest, and here is a little commercial for you. All right. You may not know about the wonderful place in here. It's called the Hawk's Nest. Hawk's Nest. Guess what? It's got t-shirts, long sleeve ones too. We got regular shirts for the ladies. We got sweatshirts. Oh, sorry, I tripped. Would you believe it? From the 27th to the 29th, these puppies, just 20 bucks. That that's called a steal. Hawk's Nest. Also, that's not where the fun ends. We got socks, lanyards, hats, fluffy stuff. That looks awesome. I can't wear it. I'm not cool enough. Hawk's Nest. But look at the great stock in here. I'm surprised I haven't seen my mom in here. Hawk's Nest. All this for the lowest price you'll find. That's a steal, but it's not a crime. Hawk's Nest. And here's a segment on sports. Hey, it's me, Madison, again, and this is Adrian. Girls softball lost to Aletha West 11-8, but three girls hit home runs in the game. They had a game Tuesday against Gardner, and they will play Lawrence tonight. And golf had a tournament Monday. Tennis had tournaments Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Baseball beat Olathe South 2-0 last Wednesday. They played at Blue Valley Northwest Monday, winning 7-6, and they played Lawrence Thursday and Shawnee Mission East Saturday. Track had a meet Monday, and they have another meet Friday. And girls swimming and diving had a meet Friday. 
Girls soccer had a game last Thursday, losing 2-1 to one to Washburn Rural. They also had a game Tuesday against Olathe North, and they played a night against Olathe South. That's it for this week, Hawks. Thanks for watching. And we'll see you next time.